video, we are going to be assessing a patient with an external ventriculostomy drain device in place, or EVD. The cables that I have here in my hand are just additional cables for additional measurements. The temperature, this one can measure ICP or intracranial pressure. But today we're going to focus on the management, assessment and management of the EVD system. So the first order of business prior to starting my assessment is for me to look at my physician orders. My neurosurgeon has ordered for it to be level at the external auditory canal and for the drainage to be left open at all times and for it to be set at 13 centimeters of water above the external auditory canal or EAC or tragus, all the same spot. So I'm going to start my assessment after looking at those orders with looking at the actual site dressing to determine if it is in fact clean, dry, and intact, and yes it is. Then I'm going to follow my tubing to make sure that the system is open. So this is off to the atmosphere, unclamped, unclamped, off to the atmosphere, so still open to the drainage system. Then I'm going to check that the clamp to my bag is off because I'm gonna empty this out every single hour and record the measurements within there. From there, I'm gonna make note of my drainage characteristics, clear and yellow, and it should be clear and colorless or clear and pale yellow for cerebral spinal fluid. Then I'm going to obtain my level, and from the EAC or tragus, I am going to place my level there and right at the center of the stopcock and make sure that it is leveled to the right spot. Then I am going to make sure that this drainage is leveled here at my 13 centimeters of water above the external auditory canal. So I know that the system is open, that it is draining properly, and I've got my drainage characteristics and my site characteristics. 